So we are coming with the force, yeah. Blessings we are reap and we call it in a handful. Oh, in a rise and boast. Yeah, we give thanks that we need it the most. We have to give thanks that we really support. Hi guys, so I just got to Lagos. I'm home in my sister's house. I know I look crazy. <sighs> you guys, I have had one heck of a day. Trust me. This morning, I nearly missed my flight. Like, I was this close to missing my flight this morning. This close. I nearly lost my phone as well because, you know, basically, I, I was nearly at the airport. Like, I was halfway there. And I remember that I forgot my passport at home. And bear in mind, I had, just a, I had just said a prayer. Like, um, the person who took me to, my friend who took me to the airport was like, let's just say a prayer. So we did. And literally, like, two minutes later, I was like, oh, my God, I left my passport. So we turned back and went all the way back home. And, like, literally, look... The counter was literally closing because it closed like 15 minutes at the time or whatever. Anyway, I get to the airport and thankfully they allow me to check in, right? And once I'm checking in, my bag is overweight. So like I'm struggling trying to, you know, do like take some things out so that, you know, everything's going to work. Eventually it does work and I'm running to immigration. Tell me why I get to immigration and everything and I'm doing my thing and then I'm like, oh my God, where's my phone? So now I have to run back to the TSA or the check-in counter, whatever they call it. And my phone is thankfully, luckily sitting over there. Look, we're going to get into it. I have to go and eat. My mom is calling me. My mama's baby food, guys. I've had homemade food in so long. Like, homemade food. So I'm going to do that. Probably will come back. I'm supposed to go and get my hair done today. My sister's driver is going to come and pick me up. So, that will probably be what's going on. Sorry I'm rambling. Sorry I'm not really, like, gisting. I just have to go now, okay? I just wanted to come in here and update and tell you guys what's going on. I'm sorry I look a mess. <laughs> it's been a day, okay? All right. See ya. So, guys, I'm about to go and get my hair done. This is just my outfit for that um, i decided to take a quick shower because i was just feeling a bit musty and like you know entering a plane sometimes it can get really dirty so yeah um i wanted to just do a quick change since i'm gonna braid my hair and have quite a long day this is thrifted this top as well is from everything girly world it's just like a simple tank i think you can get this from any website if i find something i'm gonna link it and then i don't have anything you know this is my natural hair i'm also gonna wear my sunnies this is the look and I'm out. I'm actually running late. My, my sister is even calling me, so. So, I wanted to come and show you my hair because yesterday when I got home, I couldn't. Today's Saturday, it's 6 40 a.m. There's no lights. As you can hear, the jet back there. Ugh. We're in Lagos proper. <laughs> I'm so hot already. There's no like AC here, but I just wanted to come show you guys my hair. I'm playing. Okay, I can't even tell you the ruler. I can't even tell you actually. But I'm going on set today. I don't know how I feel about this hair. I'm not even going to lie. I feel like it's not something I would typically do. Everybody keeps telling me that it suits me and that it's nice. But I feel like they're lying to me. Like, damn. But I don't know. I feel like for my character, I can own it. But like, I have to have this hair while I'm here. So even when I'm going out at night and stuff, the hair has to keep, you know, be on. But I feel like once, I mean, it's not bad. You guys should tell me. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. Like, I can't even, I can't even lie to myself right now. I just wanted to come and update you. This is my outfit. I'm just wearing this tank top from Zara. And then these are my famous baggy pants. Good morning. Today is Sunday. <laughs> yeah, I slept till like 10. Time is now 11. But to be fair, it means it's 10 in Ghana and like I feel like my mind is still programmed in Accra time. So it's not that bad, you know? Which technically means I woke up at 9, which is okay, you know? Unfortunately, I miss church. I really wanted to go to church here. Yeah. I don't know if I mentioned that I like a, a certain church here, but I couldn't go. I was slept. <laughs> Look like you need proper. Come get this vitamin D power. Be ready to touch when I reach it. I go eat it up, I don't be I make that thing go wild. I go make that thing run water. I go make you sing my song. There's a meeting in my bed. In my bed. There's a meeting in my bed. In my bed. Hey guys, so I'm back. I went to Breeze with my friends. I really need to be. <laughs> anyway, I'm doing like it gets already with me. I'm about to wrap my hair, take my makeup off type of thing. 
Um, yeah, and I really need to pee, but I, I really want to do this. Get ready with me before I pee. It's actually midnight, it's like almost 1 a.m. now, and I just got back. I left here by 9, so it was a really quick, chill thing. Reese is really pretty. I'm so sad that I didn't like take my camera stuff. I mean, honestly, I'm not too sad because I really didn't want to take my camera. But I got some pictures, it'll be popping up on the screen right about now. So. This is how I tie my hair when I'm going to bed, for anybody wondering. So, another thing I want to confess is that I really like this hair now. I don't know why I was kind of hating on it in the beginning. I wasn't really hating on it, I was just worried that, you know, it wouldn't really look so good on me. Like, it's a pretty style, but I was worried it wouldn't look, like, nice on me. I don't know why I was so worried about that, but like, you know that thing where you sleep in your hair, you wake up, take a shower and stuff and it's like okay you know after like first two days after you do your hair i feel like that's when you really start to like your hair like immediately when you get your braids fresh they never really look the way you want them to i didn't i didn't know lashes today it's pretty chill to be honest i didn't actually have the time to do my lashes yeah i think i found the best like wipes the lights not allow me to show you guys properly but like this this is amazing. I can't link it because I didn't kind of buy it online. I think it's really nice because when I'm looking for cotton pads, I don't want to have to use so many. With this, I literally just have to use like two and, you know, all my makeup is off. I had these other ones that were like round and I had to use like six of those. It was just so wasteful and it was just annoying, you know, and it wasn't as big as this as well. But these are really nice. Um, I just use regular mice all the time when I'm taking my makeup off. You guys can't really see because of the light, but yeah, it's just regular Garnier. Is it Garnier or Garnier? I don't know. But yeah, it's nice and all the time. I really like my makeup tonight, so I'm kind of sad that I have to take it off. This is my second day in Lagos, and I must say, I'm having a really different experience this time. Like, I feel like I'm here and I'm really chill. I don't know. I don't. I don't have to explain it. Like. I'm always, I'm always living here like I'm in a car, if that makes sense. And usually when I come to Lagos, it's usually like a hustle and bustle, like I'm always on the move. I mean, I am here for work typically and like music, acting and stuff like that. But like, it's so different, it's so very different this time. And I really love how, I think, I think what it is, is that I've gotten really used to Lagos. Like, in as much as, you know, this is where like I'm from and this is where my family is. In as much as, as I've been here so many times. I, I feel like um, I feel like every time I come, I don't feel like I'm he I'm here. Like I don't feel like I've been here so many times. Or I don't feel like I'm from here or I stay here or my family is here. You know what I mean? But this time, maybe because I've been here like three times already in the like in, with intervals of like maybe four months, I feel like this is home. Like this is home home. If that makes sense. Like I don't feel like oh, I'm new here. I'm a tourist or whatever. I feel like yeah, I'm a legal babe. <laughs> you know. So I think that's why I'm just like. I just feel like, yeah, I feel like it's even safe to say that I'm in between places proper because like, I feel like I've come to Lagos so much and I feel like this year, especially, I'm going to come to Lagos because last year I was in Lagos three times in the, in the year, I think, three times or twice, I don't know. But this year, I feel like I'm going to be here a lot more, probably traveling to Lagos a lot more. So it's safe to say like my two bases would be Lagos and Accra and maybe one other country, who knows? But like, that's just how I feel. That's what my spirit is telling me. Yeah, so I'm using CeraVe right now. Um, I've used this before. Like there was a time when my skincare routine had CeraVe in there, or CeraVe, whatever you call it. I don't even know why I'm saying CeraVe. CeraVe. <laughs> so yeah, I just taken them out and I just like scrub my face. I'm going in for a second. I'm going in for a second wash because I had makeup on, so I really need like more of that double cleanse. So guys, I had to pee. So I just peed and then I said that I needed to change. So anyway, um, we're done washing my face now and I've been using this at night. Typically, I really like to use this at night. It's the Live Skin Face Serum. I don't know if you guys can see that because the light may be throwing it off. But whatever I can think, I will think you guys already know me. I just do like regular drops on my face. I like to use this typically at night because of how it feels and how, what it makes my skin look, look like at night. It has more of a glowy finish and sometimes I, I want that in my day and sometimes I don't. So the days where I don't want to have like a glowy finish in the day, like it's not greasy, it's more like a glow. I can't, I can't really explain it to you, you guys are going to see. 
I've used this product before. I think I used it in one of my weekly vlogs. But like guys, I honestly, genuinely, really, really like this product. I I find it really interesting. It feels really nice. And what's crazy, you don't even need moisturizer after this. Like, you literally, all you need is literally the face wash from Lip Skin and then this face serum. But I still like to go on top of moisturizer just because I feel like in my mind, it's like, even though this says you don't need it, I feel like I still need it. Does that make sense? So like lock in all the oil, essential oils and stuff like that. I feel like this is a game changer for my face and the way it looks. Um, and lastly, I put on moisturizing lotion. This is the CeraVe one. This is the one I actually use. Just I use the one that's in like, in like a tub. I don't know, I'm sure you guys have seen that one. That one is like thicker and all. Oh, this is more of a lotion. The other one is like a cream. I also, found, I also found out that I could say a little bit more about my character in the movie that I'm actually acting, my first, my debut movie. So basically the movie is called Spiraling. That's pretty much all I can say. <laughs> but it was really interesting being on set. It was, I mean, I've done theater, but like that stage and stage and, and you know, camera work, almost like two different things, even though they're the same, if that makes sense. Like, they both have their nuances and they have their differences and stuff like that. But I feel like my state experience made like learning lines easier and stuff like that. Also, if you, if you didn't know, my dad was into movies when I was growing up, like producing and stuff. I feel like I've said this so many times, but I'm just like reiterating that because like, I feel like it makes sense in this moment. But yeah, my house typically when I was coming home every day, when I was younger, I used to see like cameras and like directors and like producers and stuff in my house. So yeah, it was just like, you know it's not it wasn't anything new it was just more like okay this time i'm actually in front of the camera you know so yeah so the last step of my nice makeup routine is just to moisturize my lips i feel like you shouldn't go to bed with crusty lips you're gonna wake up with your lips looking so dry especially like in the hamatan season so this one is a carex one i've actually never used this one but i've heard a lot of good things about it and i actually like it oh it's a carex it's carmex my light just died, which means that's my cue. This is my cue to go to bed. And thankfully it died at the right time. So I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. I don't have plans yet. Um, but we'll see as the day progresses. And yeah. Good night. <laughs>
But yeah, bye. Hi guys, today is Friday. It's a Friday night in Lagos. Excuse all of that, Lagos is a crazy city. I'm on my way to the Smiths right now to meet with Kamsi. We're having dinner and then from there we're going to make go. And then, I don't know, after that we'll see. <laughs> What's this now? Guys, this is a visual representation of Lagos. Like nobody has any chill. Everybody just wants to go as soon as the light is green. They just bring their home. Anyway. So I just wanted to come and update you. This is the first time I'm holding my hair up and I absolutely love it. Unfortunately, I couldn't show you my outfit, but this top is from AliExpress. I'm never shopping from AliExpress again. I will talk about that in another video, but never. I'm just wearing my jeans from Bershka and regular jewelry. Yeah, I'm not gonna talk too much, but yeah. So that's where I'm going. It's currently like 7.35 p.m. And yeah. Even though we preserved for seven, we're doing better this year, you know. I'm not like an hour late, so and Kamsi's not waiting for me. I think she's also on her way now. So pretty much good timing. And yeah. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. I'm so sorry I've not really been vlogging like I should. But like I've just been home. Yesterday I was home the entire day and today I was home like the whole morning. I wasn't really doing much, so I was just like it wasn't really anything to show. So I'll see you guys. Hair. And she say my hair is nice. Your makeup is nice, nice though. Like you should see it's What Hi is guys. this? Yeah, no, is it church rally? Yeah, thanks. So. <laughs> okay, I'm so glad I caught that. Anyway, wait. <laughs> <laughs> this is Lagos. Every time I take a video and something's happening, I'm just like, see, I told you, I don't even need to speak for myself. <laughs> eh? Is that it? like. No, but I, I legit, I hope they are not blocking the road because I'm just going to be so angry. Look at this record. So, I'm going to. Saving Ever After, which is my sister's business office. So I do content for her. I mean, on sweet, like, I'm the best. I feel like, don't do it. I'm breaking <laughs> Yeah. Video. Eh? That has to be in the video. It is going to be. Did you record it? Yes. <laughs> I'll put subtitles so that they even catch it. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's all I'm doing today. Where's the. Is it. Okay. The lucky one. Lucky one. Yeah, I can just go and get a chai latte mm. from. Look, that child latte saved my life. Like, it took me to Jesus. I think I'll to Lagos and be discovering things. <laughs> Wait, that we are here. Yeah, it's because I'm, be I'm being touristy. Wait, I hope... Hey, God, I beg you. God, I beg you. See, in, in Ghana, they make them so intense that... I remember the one the time I was pissed off when I was in University of Ghana. The guy just walked into my room and woke me up. Eh? From eh? my sleep. <laughs> Daphne, you don't even know what I... The blast. I said you should get... Get out, get the hell out of my room. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, as in you were sleeping? So okay, so I just finished fitting for my sister. I feel like I need to rehold my hair. It's kind of stressing me. I don't know if I should do it like this. Looks cute. Or like with the two strands. Or like tucked behind my ear. Hmm. Anyway, so now I'm off to get that jollof that I'm always raving about whenever I come to Lagos at Amala Sky. My mom also wants one, so I'll pick up, you know, a pack for her. And then I'm going to get my famous chai latte from Maple. Guys, best chai latte ever, literally. And I always get it cold. I've never had it warm. I mean, it's very, we're in a country with a very hot climate. So why should I be drinking hot things? Like, I'm not even about to sweat more so that's what's up and i just start to update ow I just hurt myself i just don't so update you okay hey so guys this is my old house like i used to live here literally 
this this one we don't live here anymore that's what i'm showing you <laughs> but my sister used to live here and we moved out so which one is that yeah it's the next it's the next right i'm on this guy Hello. that's the one okay that's fine <laughs> i want turkey um yes thank you We have secured. Guys, it's not as good today. And it's not as sweet. I'm so bummed, but it's nice. If I was there, I would have just told them to like bump up the sugar. But it's nice. And then I also got tacos. This was not my plan, but they kind of cajoled me to get it, so I decided to give in. And this is like their prawn taco. So I'm gonna taste it. So it's called one taco. I don't know if you guys can see. It's not really focusing, but it looks good. Mm. Hey guys, so I am off to the beach with Amy. I'm rushing actually. We're going to Coco, Coco Beach. And I need to be out of there because the boat's about to leave me. So bye. So I'm in the car. I'm vlogging on my camera. I mean my phone. Guys. I'm not gonna put gloss on. This is not the lip gloss. This is not the lip I'm trying to go with. I'm just do it real quick. I'm trying to go with like a lighter base. The boat leaves by five, and it's like four fifty, I think. I was looking for my food. <laughs> no, no, I'm holding the food. Dummy! I am just so used to vlogging with my camera. Anyway, <sighs> yo, this is the fastest time I've ever done my makeup. Like, I didn't even know I was going to go to the beach today. I mean, we spoke about it, but like, I didn't think. Yeah, so we spoke about it. We spoke about it, but I didn't think we had made like a final <laughs> decision. <laughs> if I get the also fine, I'll have to take the next boat. But like, the next boat comes in an hour, so it's like I'm not even gonna be on the ride with them. Mm, yeah, hopefully I make it. Okay. Bye. The boat left me. I'm gonna insert the picture. Literally, as soon as I walked in here, the boat was on its way. Just by that, but it's fine. The next one will be on its way soon, so I'm just like just waiting. And yeah, but Amy really tried for me. Like Amy, you know I love you so much. Like she stalled the boat for like 30 minutes. I kid you not, probably even 40 minutes. And unfortunately, like it's just little things that like delayed me. Like I'm not ready to get into it, shop. I just know that it's, it's been a crazy day, and yeah, pretty much. You got it, girl. You got it. You got it, girl. You got it. No, baby, and I'm back in the market. No, not a pop, but you're working. Hey guys, so I just got back home and I'm going out again. <laughs> it's literally almost 10. It's actually 10 9, so meaning I have to be out of here by like. 10 40 so i can get to amy's by 11 and then we start heading to zaza <sighs> i mean life is worth living life is to enjoy so why not you know so i'm just gonna get changed and then we go okay okay so this is it you're the only one i'm trying to make Guys, I just thought to come and update you because I left my camera at home. So I'm at the nail place. I totally forgot my my camera, and which is annoying, but it's fine. Um, I just got here, so I'm gonna be vlogging with my phone. I hate that I have to vlog with my phone, but what can we do? What can we do? What can we do? I hope I'm moving in frame. It's not easy like doing this. This is the ghetto now, guys. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I'm 
done with my nails i really like them um it took long but i did them in a different way so i think this is a gel builder i'm not sure i'm not so sure actually i should check my receipts i should have all the information hold up what is this receipt Anyway, yeah, so just nice and clean. My birthday is like two weeks away, so I'm not trying to do anything too crazy. Um, and I also just wanted to do my nails because I didn't want to get back to Accra and I have to just do like maintenance. Ideally, I wanted to get my hair done, but I'll just do that when I get to Accra. I want to do a ponytail. You guys haven't seen me in a ponytail in a while. So I think I want to do that. Right now, we are running errands for my sister. We're going to the laundromat. We're going to get water from Prince Ebano. And then we're going to the laundromat to pick up my laundry and her laundry. I'm so happy I did my laundry here. When I go home, I don't have to do laundry. I'm so excited. Like, I don't, I mean, of course, I have some dirty clothes, like what I'm wearing right now. And then what I'm going to wear tomorrow. But aside that, we Gucci. Yeah, so currently like 3 30 p.m right it's almost four so yeah I feel filthy I feel so filthy and hungry I'm tired of like everything that's going on so today was actually a successful errand day I went to get my nails done I'm sure I've shown you guys but like I'm obsessed I cannot get enough just so like timeless classic neat nothing crazy um I also got my toes done but I'm not gonna show you my toes I feel like I, I probably already did it but like <laughs> You get the drift. So I'm hungry, I'm starving. Um, I got some, guys, there's this amazing chicken grill called Greg's Grill. They make like chicken, turkey, catfish. And I've honestly only tried their chicken. And my God, it's so good. I've literally been running away from my brother because I know he's gonna say he wants some of this. But like, I had to get two packs. This, this is my sister's portion actually. I got two packs because it's that good and it's so small. And I knew that one was not going to be enough, especially because I've not eaten all day. It's literally 6. 6.20. 6.20 p.m. So, you know, you know what time it is. I've not eaten the whole day and it's 6.20 p.m. That's crazy. I just have five minutes left of recording time on my card. Guys, this chicken is so good. Mm. It's so good amazing this is my second pack i'm going to save it for later so i kind of want to try like this sauce that they put on it mm. Mm -hmm. anyway i'm gonna go and enjoy my food bye see you hi guys i feel like this ac is so high finally found a way to plant you guys down good morning Hi guys, good morning. Today is Friday, I think. No, today is actually Wednesday. And I'm on my way to... Today is Tuesday. Today is Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thanks. Oh, yeah, today is actually Tuesday. Yeah, so my flight is tomorrow, but we'll talk about that later. I keep not bringing my camera. I keep leaving it at home. Honestly, I'm carrying too many things today. I can't be bothered to, you know, hold my camera as well. Maybe I should take... No, nah, nah, I'm not going to actually... Nah, never mind. So, um, right now, I have a fitting... I have a press thing this morning for the movie I came here to do. And my, my hands are killing me. I was saying that I have a press thing this morning for a movie I came here to do the movie. Spiraling. Um, so that's where I'm about to head to. I know I don't look dressed up like i don't have earrings nothing but that's gonna change you know I'm, i was actually kind of running late so i just had to get in the car i'm gonna do my earrings wear my earrings you know remove my hair from this my hair is kind of like i did my edges so i just need them to kind of dry down late on today we're doing something exciting i'm finally going over to the studio like all this time i have not been able to go to the studio finally going to the studio later today to record some music 
I'm so excited about that. And yeah, so I'll just keep you guys posted as we go. I feel like, you know, holding my phone makes me feel like an old style blogger. Vlogger. And one thing I've noticed about vlogging on your camera and vlogging on an actual phone is that it's so different. Like, the feel. I'm just not used to this feel anymore and it's kind of bothering me like and also i'm not filming my back camera today i just cannot be bothered to do it but i love you guys how do you even do that gen z that gen z love i love you guys this is how i do my yeah I'm going downstairs. My sister driver is waiting for me to take me home. And then from there, I'm going to the studio. So <laughs> let's go. Hi guys, so good morning. It's like 10 30, 10 30 a.m., almost 11. And today we're going back to Accra. Um, yesterday was my last official day here, and so today we're going back to the land of I don't know, but we're going back to Accra basically. And yeah, that's I don't really have much to say. Um, my Lagos experience this time was. It's always something new with Lagos. I had a really good time this time around. I was out a lot, which was good and kind of refreshing. And yeah, yesterday I got to the studio, did a little something something, <laughs> which was pretty cool. Like I just, I just can't wait to like let you guys hear everything. And it's just, you know, yesterday I had a new fear which I'm not really going to dwell on or speak too much about. But, like, it's just crazy, you know? Like, life and the stages we go through and the things we realize as we get older. It's just so real. But, um, anyway, I'm just going to... I need to get it ready. The Lagos is not Accra. Like, the airport is way out of town. It's almost, like, three hours away. Two hours, 50 minutes on a good day. Two hours on a good day. But, like... I'm not about to miss my flight. My flight is for 6.50. Airpiece. Airpiece. Do not piss me off. Like, look, your time is coming. This is my first time booking with Airpiece. I've, I've heard about how they are not reliable, da-da-da-da. And I didn't listen. But to be fair, their price was cheaper than the other airline that I usually travel with, which is Africa World. But I get it now because, like, they are not, they, they are not reliable one bit. I already booked my flight and they, they tell me, Two days before the flight that they are rescheduling the time. It's supposed to be 6 p.m. and I was 6.50. I hope I don't get to the airport and they tell me that my flight has been delayed. Because I've had a friend stay at the airport till like midnight because of airpiece. So they shouldn't play with me. I'm not the one to be, you know, I'm not the one to be messed with. I'm not the one to be played with. Do not play with me. Anyway, so yeah, my flight is at 6.50. So the fact that I have to leave for the airport, start getting ready now. Okay, well, I haven't packed. But like still, you know, it's insane. Like I have to leave here 1 p.m. so I can get there on time. I mean, in time for my flight, that's that's a bit wild, but we got to do what we got to do. So I'm going to pack it up and I'm going to scoop, scoop my way out of this town. OK, so, yeah, we'll see when I get back to Accra. Please, so hot on my way to the airport, guys. My mood has literally just been ruined right now, but like it's fine. That's cute. Hey. So I'm at the airport now, just kind of like waiting to check in. It's like, where was my phone? I panicked for a little bit. It's like 3.54, if you can see. Sorry? I'm not recording you. 
I'm not recording you. It's on me. See? It's not on you. Okay, it's not on you. Don't worry. <laughs> so weird in Nigeria to film like I'm filming myself you can't tell me that yeah so they kind of assumed that I was filming them when I'm not but anyway that's cleared up so yeah we're supposed to leave by like 3.50 right 3.55 and no we're actually supposed to leave by 6.50 and it's already 3.55 hopefully check-in will open in like five minutes so I'll keep you guys updated